what's the meaning of that? Yeah? Did you call me to quarrel me this evening? What do you mean? Ah, what do you mean I sent you out of the house? I was lonely. And good enough, someone came for my hand in marriage. And I accepted. Ah, you are free to come to my house at any time. Well, not to come and live here with us. Sure, you can come. You can just come as, uh, uh, and uh, just come and stay for some days. You understand? So that now, I, 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 I've told you, I, I'm trying to explain everything to you here. Yeah? And you are still arguing. Why are you arguing? It's, it's, it's fine. It's okay. I'll, I will talk to you tomorrow. Okay? So that you are here. I'm here. <sighs> and who is this person that you're talking to on the phone, shouting and yelling like a mad woman? Ah, uh, sweetheart. Was I really yelling like a mad woman? <sighs> it's nothing I can't handle. It's just a little girl from the village. She wants to come and stay with us. But uh, I told her she can come around, but not to come and do it. Sure, okay. you know, you said you don't want family members, as in you don't want to take part in our home, right? Well, I said that because we were newly married, and it is normal that we enjoy our marriage. Welcoming a third party into the house would have been a problem for both of us. But this particular person that you were talking to on the phone, a couple of minutes ago. This is not the first time you're talking to this person on the phone. I've caught you on several locations, came in in the toilet, in the bathroom, the kitchen, talking to this same person on the phone, and you're always shouting and getting angry. Who is this person? I want to know who they are. Yeah, don't worry about this. I told you before. Don't, don't just bother. I will handle it. Anyways, I told her to come. She can just come and stay for some days and then go back. I will let you know everything when the time comes. Right, that reminds me, my father called yesterday. I, I should have told you, but I forgot. Um, oh. He said he wants to come and visit us, so I sent him our address already. Mm -hmm. Probably before weekend, we should be expecting him. That would be nice. Yeah, you said something about finding a new wife who wants to come. My father likes women. Ah, oh, I hope it's a good one. How, how old is your father, sir? You still want a wife? <laughs> Anyways, I can't wait to see him. Yeah, you know, you've never met him before. Yeah. <laughs> mm. This person we were talking to on the phone. <laughs> Should I stop that? Come and join me now. Let's stay alone. Sweetheart, are you upset or something? I don't understand. Honey. Wow, Papa. <laughs> Thank well, you. Welcome, sir. Welcome. I cannot eat the home by now. That was fast. It comes like two hours ago. Hello. Hello. Daddy, who is she? That's my wife. Your, your wife? Yes. Come, 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 come. Wow. Daddy, you're sit down. <laughs> mm. My goodness, Daddy. Yes. Uh, yeah. That's very good. So, Papa, you still have eyes for good things. So. Yeah. <laughs> it's just as fair as Mama used to be. Yeah. And your son is so handsome. Uh, yeah, you can say that. My father makes 
<laughs> honey, honey, come. My father is here. Sister, Papa is here. Come. <laughs> honey. Welcome, honey. Hello, you're welcome. Yes, my father. Your wife? Yeah. Is that what you are just amazing ways to tell me? <laughs> you're welcome. Welcome, yeah? Thank you, sir. How are you? Papa. Yes. I'm so happy for this. Yes, my daughter. Mm -hmm. Thank you, thank you, thank you. You're welcome, Papa. Thank you. Hey, sorry I have not introduced her to you. She's my wife. She's your wife? Yes. Yeah. <laughs> Juliet! What are you doing here? Mom! Why are you here? What is going on here? I don't understand. Wait, 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 wait. You, you two know each other? That's what they're saying. Just she said the much your yeah. daughter thing. Please, please. Enough of this. Okay, so can someone tell me what is going on here? What are you doing here? Is that really more? My biological mother. This is my mother. This woman right here. Get back to me. Ah, um, Papa. And the good thing is that you're not yet married to her, so you can dissolve your own part of the relationship. No, 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 son. I have gone far, done everything. She's even pregnant for me. Yes, I am pregnant for my husband. What? She's pregnant for me. So, it means now that my son is marrying a mother, and the I, the father, marrying the daughter. Oh. I can see nobody wants to talk. And thank God, Daddy is not here. Because I know he wouldn't like to engage himself in such conversation. Like, I mean, I am getting lost. Like, I am confused. So, I, I want to know, how do we address ourselves here? <clears throat> okay. You know, I, I thought about this. Last night, I didn't sleep. When Daddy walked in here with... Uh, this lady claiming she is his wife. You know, a girl that is way younger than he is. Well, that's not a big deal. I can handle that. The problem now is how do we address each other considering we're going to be living as a family in the same house, probably for a short period of time, but then we need to respect protocol. How do I address her? How does she address my wife? How do the bottom line is, I'm the man of the house, and she is still my daughter. I am not your daughter. On the contrary, you are my stepson. Automatically, that makes you my son. I call me that respect. She is my wife. You, being my father's wife, is my daughter. My father, to be my father, is still my son-in-law because he married my wife's daughter. That automatically makes me your stepmom. No way. That is not going to work in this house. You and my father cannot just come from space and you want to claim a, 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 a father-in-law and mother-in-law thing in this house. It's not going to work. If I told there's any father-in-law or mother-in-law here, it should be my wife and myself. Your husband is my son-in-law. It's okay. It's okay. In as much as he's my father, he's still my son-in-law. See that it's okay. It's okay. Juliet, I want you to know that this whole thing does not change the fact that you are still my daughter. Yes. And your husband is my son-in-law. Mommy, Mommy. he is also my own uh, father-in-law. My husband is your father-in-law. Did you just call me a daughter-in-law? Yes, ma'am. That is what you are. If you're marrying my, my, my... No! Husband, I am not your daughter-in-law. You are my daughter. Fact. Address me well. You can choose to be ignorant of this situation, but that is what it is. Okay, wait. Enough. Yes, enough, enough of all of this. this. Please. Okay, fine. Come to think of it. 
she's pregnant isn't it are you not that's very young and your mom is pregnant as well it does fine so how are your children i mean the babies how are they going to address themselves yes that's my question because i am I, I am lost already well i did not create this situation did i so when we get to that bridge we'll cross it do it be mindful of what you say under this roof. Hmm. This thing remains my house and my husband's house. Can you calm down. Juliet, you're claiming to be my wife's mother-in-law. So who then is she to you and your husband? She is my mom. And the baby she's having. You or she will be my sibling. At the same time, my grandchild. Juliet, I, I won't tolerate this nonsense under my roof. Yes. The end point here is that the only father-in-law and mother-in-law in this house is my wife and myself. The other couple, they are our son-in-law and our daughter-in-law, right? Lies. Everybody should just mind his or her name in this house. Yes. Exactly. I love that. What she's trying to say is that from now henceforth, everybody should stay in his or her name. That's all. If I see you and greet you, you are set. If I do not greet you, please maintain your name. Juliet, that's what she's that's trying to all. say. Juliet, Juliet, I think that will not take place under this roof. I will suggest we just open the door and start leaving because I, I don't think I will be able to tolerate that.